We're joined today by Dr. Tom Lavin as well as Gloria. Thank you both for being here. Thank you. And so, first of all, what does POSE stand for? Primary obesity surgery and aluminal, which basically just means incisionless, through the mouth uh, procedure, outpatient procedure for weight loss. This is for a group of patients not like the standard bariatric patient. These patients need to lose 25 to 50 or 60 pounds, not 100 or 200 pounds. And of course, it's done all uh, through the mouth, no incisions, outpatient, it takes about 40 minutes. So quick return to normal. A lot of our patients don't even tell anyone they're getting it done. So there's a high degree of secrecy or discreetness when they get it done. Now, this is the device you use, which it's FDA approved, but I should mention this, this device is actually, you're using it off-label to do this procedure, is that correct? This procedure is not um, FDA approved for weight loss, but it's, used, but it's FDA approved for any, uh, any procedure for tissue approximation. So. so can you show us what you're doing? Because again, you're going in through the mouth. Sure. We've got a big prop stomach over here. Okay, so first of all, the patient goes to sleep in the OR, so they're totally asleep, and then we go down the mouth and enter the stomach right here, and you can see that, and I'm able to look all the way around the stomach just by turning the little knobs. And what we do is initially, we will address the top part of the stomach and then shrink it going all the way down, predominantly up here and then in, down at the base of the stomach. So when we do the procedure, um, like you saw in, in the beginning portion, this actually comes out and we're able to take a fold. Travis, can you just hold, hold that? And so what we do is I will grab a portion of the gastric wall like that and close it on the gastric wall. And then, okay, you can let go now, I'm gonna flip it. So now you can see the little needle will come through and then the basket will come out. And then we pull that back, pop it open right there. And then I let the back basket out and then I cinch it up tight. And that gives you that big fold of stomach. So, so you're it. really suturing the wall of the stomach together to decrease its size? Right. And we do that about 15 times as we travel down the stomach, and it significantly shrinks the whole capacity of the stomach and takes away a lot of their hunger and cravings. Now, Gloria, how are you feeling since you had the procedure done? I feel great. I've lost 26 pounds and counting, and um, it's been a wonderful day. Have you noticed? A difference in terms of your hunger, the way you eat? Absolutely. Initially, um, I had no hunger at all. But um, it started to increase, but I can still manage it enough so that I can retrain myself to eat better and keep losing the weight. So what happens long term for Gloria? Because she, she's had essentially her stomach <laughs> internally, the right. size of it has, has decreased. Right. Um, by the example you just showed there, what, what happens to her stomach over the long term then? Well, when... When we actually put these little baskets in place, the outside of the stomach actually grows together, okay? So that is a permanent anatomic change. So her stomach is changed forever. We're only out about four years, so we really can't predict, you know, 10, 20 years down the road. We just know over that period of time, patients are able to lose weight and uh, decrease hunger and decrease capacity. And this is one of those things, like you said, for people who don't maybe have that 100 plus pounds to lose. And Gloria, you seem very happy. We're, we're glad that you're doing well. You're Thank feeling you. good. And I am. That's what's most important. We wish you the best of continued Thank success. You. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming Thank on you. and sharing this with us.